guys. It's uh, MOV Whiskey. And I found something you guys might be more interested in uh, than Men of War Assault Squad 2. Because uh, it's kind of an older game and it doesn't have as great of an audience. This is Cross Out. You may have seen like uh, Dragast and uh, ETAC, I believe play this uh, also fly daily and Baron Von games they've also played this uh, this is made uh, this is basically Mad Max meets uh, Robocraft on Steam you know where you it's a bunch of blocks and you build tanks and stuff it's basically that and uh, let me just show you this I've I've worked on a lot of cars in like the last two days this is uh, the recent thing I've made is two 20 millimeter auto cannons and a bunch of bunch of other stuff and uh, does this <laughs> uh, d uh, not very high level because I, I literally just started this yesterday because I saw Dragas play it yesterday and I was like I gotta get this so this is the test driving you know you can test drive anything uh, after you built it to see how it works I'm just uh, oh I do so on the sides are 20 millimeter auto cannons literally everything else is just armor uh, except for the front that very front thing those two front things that look like swords those are called hatchets for some weird reason yeah they uh they're melee weapons so you basically go as fast as you can into your enemy and do like a couple hundred damage yeah pretty much uh... <coughs> this car I built it never tested it in battle don't want to it's kinda of, uh, it's like it looks alright except for maybe these but uh... I wanna build a new car for you guys so I'm gonna do that e just delete everything cause I wanna show you uh... how, you, how this game can be uh... like what can be done in this game did some interesting things there uh... so I don't have a lot of stuff. So there are these are the cabins, they provide your power. These are what you build the, these frames are what you build the cannons on. These are your weapons. Uh this is hardware that they can uh, I'll tell you what those do later. Wheels, uh more and then there's a bunch of structure parts and these are resources and dies and uh decor. So we go to frame. We take this four by four. Go like this. Copy a couple pieces. Uh, huh. uh, then we go. Oh, I do that. It's really easy to X out of this builder on accident. You'll probably see me do a lot of that. And take this smaller frame and go like this. Sadly, they don't have like a mimic option, which would be fucking amazing. Not gonna lie, like. You, you can mimic it on the other side. Uh, I think it's like that. Yeah, it is. Alright. And then we can go... See, the reason I chose this, the Wavering Cabin, is... Uh, this is in closed beta, so you have to pay like $20 to get into it, and you get like a car, and it carries over to when the game will be released. And so this is the cabin from it, and it gives me the most energy, which is temp points, and energy is taken by hardware and weaponry. So you kind of want the one with the most, uh, like, like a good balance of energy, mass, and structure, and derb, and uh, and all that, <laughs> pretty much. And then, uh, so we go out of frame, uh, weapons. There is. You get it when the game's released because it's gonna be a free-to-play game with some pay to. It's, it's basically there's gonna be some pay to win. Uh, there's this starter mini gun, which is what you get. Uh, light machine guns, shotguns, and you can get rares. There's this, like common uh, or like uncommon or like super common or whatever, like whatever this is. I don't I don't know. Common. Rare, uh, I think this is, uh, actually, I think this is, I don't know, I don't know what blue is, it's like, ep you know, like, epic, like, rare, epic, legendary, and I, I don't, I, I don't know what that, this is, but, uh, so, 
go to all just reselect it uh, so cannons they usually have the lowest amount of ammo but if you get a hit they do the most damage and they also take the longest to reload auto cannons and like these 20 millimeters uh, they're usually they're kind of the mix between a machine gun and a cannon obviously uh, they they're the great accuracy is kind of kind of depends I I tend to notice that they're not exactly too accurate but they do they do more damage than a machine gun less damage than a cannon so they're kind of the best of both worlds they both these both take five points of energy so it's kind of like you want to go bang 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 with a low cooldown doing like 55 damage with a couple machine guns and it's like wait no it's like 50 with two but that, that's the gist of that uh, there's hardware light engine it increase it takes one point of energy so you can't uh, like it, that me that changes like all your weapon layouts and it uh, can accelerate the vehicle to very very high speeds but the acceleration decreases with increase so the heavier you make your vehicle the the worse that's gonna do once it's uh, like trying to accelerate weapon radiator so when you have like four machine guns they uh, heat up and they need to cool down this cools them down faster uh, radar let, yeah, increase radius of detection radio increase uh, basically like you can receive things and send things to your teammates faster so your teammates spot an enemy you get it faster like uh, if you're in that this is a, a booster you press like you press F and it'll boost you if you have a line off car so this is a car jack and if you place it on your car and your car gets flipped you can flip it back over and fuel is a you receive fuel I don't actually know except uh, if it gets blown up when it has fuel in it uh, it blows up and it does a lot of damage uh, then there is a <coughs> movement you know wheels you can get different types of wheels it's not not a lot from what I've seen structure it's a bunch of stuff for armor and the melee weapons this is a melee weapon which it's like one of the worst decor they give you extra Reputation is basically experience. The more you can fit on, the better your experience gain. Dies is painting your car, and resources is res is crafting pretty much. So it's crafting and stuff. But what I really want to do is continue building this car. Uh, so, hmm, I kind of want this to be a machine gun car. <laughs> So you can rotate. Uh, the rotating is kind of confusing in this game sometimes. Uh, nope. Uh, uh, no, it means it's R. So you can do that. And it's a machine gun. There's like two machine guns. They're not going to do much without backup support from you know other machine guns so we get into structure we need to start building Ooh, what are I don't really want to mount these other ones give me a second to think Alright guys, so as you can see, I've I decided not to go all machine guns, so these take two, two, four, nine. Alright, 
So that means I have one more point of energy, which I will spend in this engine to accelerate us. So this is basically, uh, basically kind of, kind of it. You know, you do, you do this stuff. Uh, now I needed to protect the very front of this. Boom, there we go, twin slope. Or, wait, see if you double tap, tab, that's, you'll do that. Ah, no, that's still gonna leave a giant hole. So, no, I'll go with the twin slope. That one look good. So I'm gonna need some wheels soon. I'm gonna move these up. <laughs> Hopefully, because I gotta deal with wheels. Uh, I'm actually gonna move these back one. So I have space for the wheels. <laughs> so, movement. We got medium wheels and small wheels. I'm gonna go for medium wheels. ST stands for steering. Yeah, it's like right behind it. Yep. Alright, then we'll go just regular medium wheels. in the very back, yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, okay. uh... Yeah, see, the thing is, is, uh... Your wheels can take damage, and I kinda... That kinda happened to one of my wheels, like, it, the durability wore all the way down, so, uh... This is a steering wheel. <laughs> in the very back. Uh, alright. Now we go back to hardware. Always take this radio, because radios don't... If you have the space, radios don't take any, uh, power. So we go back to structure. We need to start armoring up the car. So, uh, put this fender on. If I can put the fender on there. So, usually what you'd want to use a fender for is, a. Uh, on like, like on small wheels, you can put a fender extender, which gives, which is in the decor, and it gives you a experience. Yeah, double tabbed right there. And there we go, uh, and then. As you can see, I use a lot of these van pieces. Now, each time I place a piece like this, it increases my power score, which is incre which increases the type of people that I play with. Like, they'll be more experienced. Uh, and I did just get a Steve message, so I'll take a look. Alright, don't need to worry about it. Uh, so I'm gonna take this narrow wing. I'm gonna try and make it work. Come okay, on. Uh, no, I have a better one. Long pipe shield. Much better. Uh -huh. Really like using these twin slopes. I think they they look pretty nice. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Yep. 
Sadly, they don't have like the whole like uh, War Thunder thing where like different angled armors like have different penetration chances and stuff. It, it's it would be up. Oh, move there. Uh, why do I want this? You know what? I'm gonna move. Uh, not what I wanted. There we go. I'm gonna put it like that because I have a. Go down. Get these hatchets. So I can shank some people. <sighs> hmm. I guess I'll forget about it for now. I'm gonna use something. Uh, these van roofs, for me, uh, I use them a lot. Microsoft update. You didn't see it, but it happened for me. Uh, I need something to protect the back end of this. It's gonna be hard. I'll use these aviation small, small. Nope, that's not the right place. There we go. Uh, and then we take this. <laughs> it's like <laughs> that doesn't look good, in my opinion. And you can actually connect these pipes, and it can actually look really good. But I find it hard to like s incorporate very well. I'm gonna double up on the panels right here, just because you can literally get shot from the top and wrecked. Uh, let's take another. i uh, take a van side to the back. Just to give it extra protection. Uh, then I'll. This is where it's gonna get a bit. Just a bit uneven. Aha, there. Oh, no, 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 no. Then you just stay there. I want this. To, uh. Wait, I can't place it. Uh, uh. Never mind then. Take this AV, a small pipe. Ah, oh, damn. That's annoying me. Right. Oh, wait. Should I have a better idea? We take this. Place it in the middle. Take this. Place it right here. Yeah, there we go. All right. Actually, it's, I want to check something really quick. Aha! That's what I thought. Now, can I? Oh, yes, I can. Okay, so this grill is basically just extra protection from the back. It'll take, it'll soak up some damage when needed. Now, if I wanted to, and I had enough power points, I could mount like machine gun or thing here. And uh, yeah, as you can see, this kind of looks nasty, but it's kind of how it's got to roll. I, I don't think I could put anything in there. Maybe a van side? Oh, I can. I can fit it like right at the. Come on. I can fit it right there. Slightly forward, just a bit. Not slightly forward. This way. Goes to the edge of these? No, but it can. Well, not on this side. This one must be. No, that's as far as it can go. All right, I'll just leave that one like that for now. All right, so let's test drive this because that's pretty much all I can do. Yep. It's 
It takes quite a while to actually, you know, get to the front. I'm a backup for a ram. I can actually not shoot behind, directly behind me. <laughs> uh, I just realized that. Right. With that engine, since I am pretty light. Oh, one damage. Oh, bull. Alright. Ram. That's annoying me. Let's try this. This is like direct. Yeah, because if somebody uh, hits that engine, it will blow up. And that won't be good. So let's go. Eleven. Oh. Just destroy him. I'll just destroy it with bullets. Alright, let's go into a battle. So I'm gonna go get the wheels because you can get medium wheels. It's like this is PvP, so I will suck. I'll let you know. You start out with PVE, and it's pretty easy. All right, so I gotta wait till next round. Uh, let's. I want to see something. Alright, so this guy, so far, has the biggest gun that I've seen. It's a 25. Sadly, I, ha I haven't seen anyone with a cannon. That may just be because some of them are dead, or that may just be because I, uh, I'm, uh, I have a low power score. So I can't, s so, uh, I'm not, hi I'm not high enough in power score to, uh, see the cannons. There's no team damage, so that guy can crash into his teammate all he wants. We'll just be jackass. Pretty much. As you can see, his exhaust's on the sides. That's basically just to increase uh, increase reputation gain. Actually, I th I think he does. I think there there should be a cannon in here at least. Is these guys these guys have high power score? I didn't even look at the power score of the one I built. I have I have built some crazy things. Not as crazy as some of the things you can see in the exhibition, which I'll show you after a couple matches. Oh, he lost his gun. So these hatchets, as you can see, he's crashing into this guy to try and make him explode because he lost his cannon. He lost his 25mm cannon, which is sad for him. Both of his... T both have a... Ah, uh, yes, yeah, see, we are capping their uh, point, and they don't realize it, so no matter what, we'll win, but he's lost his wheels his cannon, and all he has left are his hatchets, so he has to rely on daylight, which will not help him. <laughs> Alright. This guy has machine guns, and he had a cannon, I believe. He has two small plows. Plows are melee weapons. Since the round's over, it doesn't immediately switch to the end screen for me. It'll just go to loading. This guy has a howitzer on his small car. Alright, I have, okay, so I have nearly 3,000, so I'm playing with pretty high people. It's three players versus three players, and the rest are all bots. So, we're obviously going to be the better, sometimes, sometimes the bots are good. Uh, oh, we didn't go to tier base. That guy was trying to type very fast. They have machine guns and an auto cannon. Right. Oh. oh, this could be bad. I could be walking right into a howitzer. Let 
I'm going for the cap. I can still shoot. Oh, yep. Oh god, this guy chose a lot of machine guns to run away! I, yeah, see. Uh, I lost, I didn't lose any weapons, but I did lose that back steering wheel. Uh, they're targeting me, why? Don't do that. You jackasses. I lost both back wheels, so now I'm really out of control in my steering ratio. Well, lost a lot of stuff. Oh, we lost. They captured it. He's like, go for their base. Nobody went for their base. <laughs> Alright, so, uh, we failed, so I didn't get anything. I didn't kill anybody. So I think this car might suck. Yep, I may go back to. I may. Do some switcheroonies. Yeah, me. Right, now it's four players versus four players. I'm gonna go with my teammates. They are going left. That means. <laughs> oh god. They're probably gonna be coming. They, they they tend to all go one way. All the bots go one way as well. Literally, the bots will pretty much all just go one way. I have an idea. Since I have a lot of wheels, I can make that jump pretty well. I have a nice going for the sneaky cap. Oh, I don't have a radar. That would have been nice. After this, I'll show you guys the exhibition, which is where people upload their uh, creations. Vehicles of mass destruction. They, there, there must be big fight. I've destroyed his uh. <laughs> oh, he took my kill, jackass. Oh, he destroyed one of my machine guns, and we win. They all got killed. So, I'll show you the victory screen. Uh, I got a pickup cabin, which is not too good, and I got a couple scrap and stuff. And some wire. So, that's, that's the main premise of this game. I'm going to be playing it a lot. But here's the exhibition. Uh... Hmm. Will load. <laughs> Will load. <laughs> well, guys, uh, these are some of the creations, and, uh, Well, this Street's Destroyer Test Drive. I love Test Drive, this stuff. The 
this has I think this has a an a hundred. I think this has an a hundred millimeter. Anyways, that's one. I like using the ones with big cannons. Uh use this. This is a hoverer. That's that's not hovering. He lied to me. Looks like it's hovering. Or I I don't actually know if I'm reading that right now that I think of it. This is a stug three. So see the one thing I love about tank tracks in this game, I don't have any but I've test driven uh things that I have and it's you can turn in place and that's amazing. So he has a light machine gun on his, and I do believe it is a hundred millim. Uh, actually, this looks more like a seventy-six millimeter mortar. I mean, how is it? But I don't know. It doesn't actually say what's on it. Let's go to page. Oh no. Three. Uh, this thing. <laughs> got a bunch of saws and oglers and machine guns and a chameleon <laughs> so it's got two light machine guns but its main purpose is obviously to do to do this those two things those are those two spear looking things are explosive spears and they do that <laughs> You lose all <laughs> using those explosive spears. You lose like two saws. <laughs> all right, that's interesting. I had tested this earlier, like yesterday. This tank has a, I believe it's a one is I think it's a turreted 76 and then a hundred millimeter. Oh, navels. That was the 76. That's the 100. <laughs> <laughs> this is them both. So, so what I loved to do was pressing O to spawn in O to spawn in bots, waiting for them to come at me because the traverse rate is f amazing. I'm going, I'm just wrecking them. Uh, yeah, that's a guy with a shotgun, so he's gonna get close, and it's always nice. <laughs> He's blown to bits. <laughs> I love that. That's that's hilarious. Oh, the guy was over here still shooting at me. Oh, now the that guy shooting at me. Oh, he's instantly destroyed because I hit him right in the chest. That guy's dead. Let's go over towards this guy. Doesn't go like the fastest, but God, that traverse rate is so amazing. I love it because it's like, oh, there's a guy behind me. That turning circle is so small. When when in motion, obviously, it's, <laughs> this is like <laughs> I just love killing the bots. But I also know like exactly where one spawns. It's like right here. <laughs> It's so much fun. Uh. Uh. What the? Oh, <laughs> I want to see. Oh, oh, it's much different than I thought. It's 276. Uh. I suppose it's meant to fire like that, <laughs> but it knocks it up so far. <laughs> All right, that's what I thought would happen. Battle bus. Uh, that's. Does this have? A, I think these. Yeah, this does. It has. This is all just guided rockets. Don't know. Don't know why he needs. The. Uh, no, that guy's retarded. 
Yeah, that's that's just the homing rockets. What in the world is on the? F oh, it's supposed to be like a motorcycle, a sidecar. This thing is really slow. <laughs> oh my god! What? So many tr triangle tracks. I th these are two 25 millimeter auto cannons. Oh god, they do so much more damage. Uh, this is this has a hundred. Uh, <laughs> says uh 20 millimeter auto cannon and a b and three saws. A bunch of hatchets or twin blades, I think. <laughs> That's just how dangerous saws can be if you don't like take them. Ooh, that's like a proper truck. Oh wait, <laughs> is the howitzers on the side? Oh god. Does it does it like move it? Like I'd imagine that when you fire one, yeah, it does. But you, you have to go. Oh my god! And then you gotta go. Cause if you face it straight, oh, that's that's pretty cool. But like, if you're too far away, you can't shoot sh uh, straight at them. Come, Bamus. So this is a giant come. Fine machine. It's actually way too front heavy. This is literally the most front heavy thing in the world. It's getting stuck on all these little bumps. Yeah, only one's engaging because. Oh my god, Jesus. Oh my god, we gotta. I gotta retest that. So, one, I was not doing a lot, but if you, like, cause I, that was only against the hatchet, cause I have the hatchet sticking out, but let's, let's see. Dev fucking shredded through everything, Jesus. That's just, uh, okay, echoing K, what the f is this supposed this is this is a plane this is a plane nice so I gotta get this to some place where I can take off I don't know exactly where there's no guns he's just basically trying to make a plane oh come on damn small wheels <laughs> there we go it's such a short boost Cause these are those are rocket engines too. Alright. Alright. Sorry about that. Uh, I think this is the. Yeah, this is a fully rotating 120 millimeter. It can go in every, every direction. Rockets. All I know is I can take two rocket hits. Oh, come on, really. That's interesting. Uh, okay. uh, I just <laughs> I love that when do you find the 
One with just cannons. Oh. Okay, so this is if your car gets flipped. How would I? F no. I'm gonna try and flip the car. I don't think it will work because it'd need a frame for the. T yeah. God, this water <laughs> bugs down so fast. It's my mom. Yeah. Let's see. Can I flip this? Again, guys, I make long videos. That doesn't work. Tunnel tank. Alright, interesting, interesting. Uh, and yeah. Or you test drive, I won't do it immediately. Because I think I'm supposed to be going forward. Oh my god. <laughs> That's hilarious. Oh, but that happens. Oh, and then I can't get it back up because I'm not good enough. Uh, it's pretty interesting. It's a wheel. Well, yeah, people just make really long cars. I believe that is... <laughs> oh, it's a half track. Uh, it's an El Camino. Just like Warba. <laughs> That's gonna flip. I know it. Interesting enough, interesting. Uh, an actual. Oh, this guy made the actual minivan that you can make with all the minivan parts. Intriguing. <laughs> uh, this guy tried to make an airplane as well. Broad, yeah, Ruski broadside, military tech. Wait, what? What's on this? It's like a dual machine gun. I've never seen this before. That seems badass. Well. <laughs> Another combine is weak. Oh god. <laughs> Boy van. Uh, drag. Ooh. That's how good it seems. Oh my god. Wait, why did. Oh, dude. <laughs> it's, 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 it's an actual drag racer. That's pretty funny. <laughs> I I was thinking he should have rockets on these. <laughs> That's pretty funny. That's pretty cool actually. Not gonna lie. Uh huh. Oh, that's actually a pretty cool. That's actually like pretty tanky. It actually kind of looks like a tank. Half track with the can. A scorpion? What enough? Where's the. Uh, the cannon's. Sh inside now is it? Oh, the camera angle is killing me. Yeah, it is. It comes straight out the same. Oh, 
Oh my god. That's that's actually a pretty crazy idea. It probably wouldn't. You need to wait for like someone to like sneak by. A bunch of people just make the vans. You need to wait for like someone to sneak by and then you like trap them. The sniper tank. I can I even get this out of here? God, these camera angles. No, I can't even get it out. Oh, that's that's actually pretty cool. It's kind of like the same designs over and over. I'm trying to find like cool one. Wait, that that definitely had. Yeah, that's definitely hundred millimeter mortar. Oh yeah, chicken stealer. I've seen a version of that on uh, Fly Daily's videos. I'm, I'm gonna find one last vehicle for you guys. It's like pretty cool. Pretty interesting. There's another drag racer. Man. It's, it's starting to be a lot of the same cars. Like same designs, nah. So far, really none of them. Wait. This has like two. <laughs> oh, these are like two a hundred. Oh god, they are. They're two a hundred millimeter mortars. Wait, this didn't. F oh my god, this is pretty sturdy then. This is really fucking sturdy. This is really sturdy. That's really sturdy. All right, guys, I'm uh, I'm gonna leave this one here. Uh, it's a pretty long video, I know. It's almost an hour, but uh, this is a fun game. I I will be doing more of it. So, I'll catch you on the flip side.